people might be wondering, you know, why, why would you record the, you know, why do the recorded video? Not, why not get on a video conference or get on a phone call or whatever? And, you know, video conferences and phone calls have their place. But what you just offered there was, you know, someone emailed you with a bunch of questions. And so video email allows you to manage both time and distance. So if you're working with people who are out of state or out of the country, this allows you to like close that distance down and have that kind of face time with people or at least get your face in front of theirs. And it overcomes time, right? We don't have to coordinate that we're going to both get on the phone or get on a Zoom call or whatever, you know, at three o'clock, you know, central time. Oh, wait, but I'm in Pacific, but I'm in Mountain. Like all that, you know, that whole level of coordination. This is they email you questions as the questions arise. You're busy, you're out, you're showing a couple listings. Uh, and, and you're cleaning up your inbox at four o'clock in the afternoon. So you just hit record and you address them, bang, 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 bang. You save some time as we already established. And then they open it up maybe the next day or a day and a half later. They open up two seconds after you send it, but you're answering them when it's convenient for you. And they're opening it up and experiencing you in person and getting all of their questions answered when it's convenient for them. So this asynchronicity Combined with the FaceTime allows you to overcome the time and distance that keep us apart from having these kind of more personal moments. And so uh, it's just really powerful to have that convenience on both the sending and the receiving side. 